Here's an update video on the progress of the 3D printed FPG. I have a WG18C in this one and an Elite Force G17 in this one right here. This has this lowers from a older print. This one's a drop in trigger housing version. You have a shooting video of this one, shooting test video. This one's ABS printed. It actually kind of shot decently. Only issue is there's no real place for a trigger guard in it. That kind of like crap too. That printer is not like ABS at all. Put that aside. Move on to the WE. Yeah, it won't stay in there very well. That popped in there just right. For the guts of the thing. There. Most of the brakes I've had is down are down in here. You got the charging handle, or the charging handle carrier right here. Slide off. That's the part where three D printed the trigger housing inside of it. Because if I didn't, there would be no would not be enough room under here for the trigger guard. Pop right in there, huh? Well, that part did cut out. Did some cut cutting right there because I had issues with it. The slide hitting that and jamming. There's the uh, underside of it. Slide back on. There. Put the upper back on it. Fold it back up. Move on to the Elite Force. Kind of a little rough right here in the print. That was PLA and now it's PLA2. Yeah, it does not want to go pop in there just right. Trigger there. Doesn't want to go all the way in there. I have to make adjustments on that. A little tougher on that one. A little tougher pull. So look at the upper on this one, underside of the upper. Put uh, spacers for the springs. The springs were too big. Kind of didn't want to cool them around or have them slip around each other. I 
did do a Gen 4 grip here. I 3D printed the mag release too. Pull the slide off. It's got a little easier in the Wii. And this, one, this one also has a integrated uh, trigger housing. About the same thing between the two. Uppers, stocks, back covers, grips, trigger guard. Probably redo the trigger on this one. The front uh, foregrip. Everything is the same except for the lower on these two. Underside on this one. Connecting springs there, main springs. I took a compression spring and tried to turn it into a torsion spring. Kind of worked out, but not too well though. Not as well with an actual torsion spring though. Crazy to get back on there. Fold it back up. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.